channel. You received our distress signal. Mother will be pleased. What? Visitors? Look at you now, a real chip off the old monolith, huh? Just the right sort to save us from the coming cataclysm. Come on! We agreed. I was handling orientation protocol. Sorry, Lloyd. It's just too exciting. We are in crisis, Tenko. Our defense against the Grey Strain has failed. The Necrolisk is in lockdown, but it doesn't matter. The infestation has compromised the very heart itself. We have been forced to rephase into Martian... But how are you, anyway? Things good? As I was saying, our defense situation is dire. Our remaining Necromechs have reverted to their autonomous kill precepts. They will not distinguish you from those things. I call that one Fighty Scratchikins. It is imperative you meet Mother, receive her instructions, and prevent the imminent intradimensional catastrophe. Demonstrate your combat readiness, and I will grant you the requisite security kits. Good luck. Interdimensional what? Oh, Jack, I've already explained it. Sounds like it bears repeating, Lord. If we were unclear, Demonstrate your readiness by destroying infestation. Only then will I grant entry clearance. Act accordingly. Hive located. Destroy it with weapon fire. That's your favorite attention. Hostiles incoming.
crystals down. Move on and destroy the next hive. Quiet. That means we won! Clearance approved, Tenno. I now grant access to the Necrolisk. Mother awaits. But I should warn you, she is not entirely herself.
The infestation wormed into everything. After the Great Purge, there were no Dax. No Tenno to defend the place. Just us. It's not your fault, Ship. Technically, it is. And now you face an existential threat. If the heart stops beating, the wellspring of your power dies with it. Have we tried turning it off and on again? Tenno, meet the head of the Entrati family. What's left of her anyway? Mother, wake up. before us. I... I had my... my proofs. My father's. I could hear him. I could hear him tapping, tapping at the untimed door. Mother? We went in, but again, he wasn't there. My husband congratulated me. Sarcastic halfwit. All the while, Hiveweed was sprouting all around us. But, it was just a dream. No, Mother. You did all of that. You're as wormed as the rest of this place. The heart is about to fail, remember? Oh. Oh. Oh, fuck. Functional? We are. And we've summoned Ship here to help us. <sighs> It'll take more than an old Orokin thug to keep the heart beating. I don't blame you. You're just the product. The Orokin had no respect for my father's work, though I suppose you proved him right in the end. Same as Deimos. The infestation got in. Got to me and my family. Stole our names, our ideas. I can hear its high voice scratching in my mind. Let the heart stop beating. Let the door close forever. Only my dreams seem real now, so... <sighs> I sleep. It's what makes you special. You know that, right? All thanks to my father. It pumps the arteries of the here and the void. The Entrati family has maintained it for an age. But it's breaking down, and only that idiot knows how to fix it. The man I used to call my husband. I think he's left for good this time. Hmm, maybe you can find him. Probably sulking somewhere outside. Detecting active necromech signals nearby. It could be father. He loves a good fight. Whatever you do, don't mention mother. Nothing he hates more.
this must be one of the last of Father's necromax. It won't last long. Defender falls. Rest well, noble warrior. May you someday rise again. Now, to business. Guidance signal was coming from over there.
fight well for a runt frame. If you're ever interested in something a little more old war sized. Wait, wait. She didn't send you looking for me, did she? Uh, I am not going back. Mm. Look, you were the second wave, kid. The Necromex were void shielded, sentient pulse immune. As bright as a bag of hammers, and just as dependable. Not like you. <laughs> when I met her, mother, she was as brilliant as she was broken. Chasing her father's ghost, convinced he was still out there. I thought... Huh, I thought I could fix things. I thought I could fix her. Like she was a loose light board or leaky hydraulic. So yes, she's right about me. I am an idiot. But I'm a reformed idiot. I'm done with her. This heart is breaking down is just another tactic of hers. Don't you see? Everything has to be about her. That went well. We must prove to Father that the heart is deteriorating. This will be more dangerous than any grey strain monster we faced. We have to talk to... Daughter. You a fascinating specimen. Organic fares exoflesh, hybridized internals, and time trace. You're a Tenno, aren't you? You need me to tell you where it is, which I wouldn't have to bother with if not for my parents whose collective heads are so far up their collective lower sigmoids, the only air they breathe just... is what they secrete. Aw, oh, that's kind of sweet. But look at us. 
We are beyond help. The disease vectors are too complex, changing faster than I can study them. <sighs> we can only prolong the inevitable. Look, if you help me get back some of what my brother shredded, I'd be happy to return the favor. Deal? You're going to help me rebuild my sample collection. You're probably wondering what happened to it in the first place. Why don't you ask Brother when you see him? We call that worm Fass. Don't worry about him though. He's got bigger problems than you. His sister, they don't get along, as you'll soon see. opportunity for you, actually. There should be useful detritus falling from the explosion. Try not to get crushed, little one. Don't feel the least bit sad for him. He'll regenerate and even empty your head and exact his revenge. An endless cycle. Rome's the only proof I've got that the hive mind can be divided. Just collect what you can so you can get to the task at hand.
Note the curious way they float above the surface to feed. Don't bother trying to spear them in the exocrine itself. Too damn viscous. Their biology is crucial to my study. Infested, but not entangled in shared consciousness. If there's a hope in halting our mental decline, it might be here in these humble little specimens. Get to it! Looks like you've got the hang of it. But you have to understand, helping my so-called family is the last thing I'm inclined to do. You'll have to make it worthwhile. All right, that's enough. Return the specimens to me and I'll give Lloyd what he needs to take you down to the heart. I cannot open the gate with hostiles in proximity. You'll need to destroy them before I even think of powering the door. remember my birthday. Woke with a knot in my stomach. The hum of my specimen tanks was missing. Silent. But I was surprised to find a little box wrapped in a red bow. A gift from my family that never ever remembered. The note said, best wishes for my best sis. Can you guess what was in the box? A white powder, as smooth and fine as silk. My entire collection, cremated, atomized, and returned as a gift by my deranged brother. If you see him on your descent to the heart, don't be fooled. He'll stab you in the back if he thinks it'll get him a moment's notice from mother. Proceed to the heart. Otak and I will take a damage assessment scan of it. Lots of bitey scratchikins on the scope. <gasps> Maybe they're planning a party for you!
Noticed my collar, did you? A not-so-gentle reminder from dearest mother. No one in the universe can hold a grudge as deep or as long. She took away all my Entrati command words with it. Lloyd's got more respect in this family than I do. One simple mistake. To be fair, it was not exactly a simple mistake. How many times do I have to say I'm sorry? I broke the containment protocol. I carried the spores in. I screwed up. And suddenly, they all acknowledged my existence. Suddenly, something I'd done actually mattered. As if humiliating me would undo what happened to them. We're a lost cause. The infestation will come for what's left of us in time. <sighs> Speak of them, and they shall appear. Admit it, Tenno. It's beautiful, isn't it? Maybe it's not the abomination you think it is. Maybe it knows better than Mother. Maybe we ought to succumb to it. Let it go. Sun has strange ideas about what victory looks like. The solar rails, the Tenno. We all depend on the heart to keep the wall open to the other side. If the heart stops, everything goes with it. Oh, but think of all the time we'd have for hobbies! Cipher. I'm embarrassed to say I'm unsure what to make of this. Tenno, can you figure it out? What's up, Chip? Why aren't you doing the thing? Do the thing. Do the thing, Chip. Do it. Do it. Okay, I'll do it. That doesn't sound happy. Don't distract them. This is very mentally taxing for a Tenno. Hmm. You seem to be limb lurly indisposed. Let all Otag help you out. Success!
I didn't expect to get through the door before I had a chance to finish. Forgive me. This is the only way. By the heart, it's dead. The wall's closing, Mother. It's over. Good. Good. You think this is good? Oh, so you're talking to us now. Mother, don't. This isn't the time. Shut up. I want to see how low she can dig. Of course you do. Anything to make you feel better about yourself. I wonder where he gets that from. Stop. <sighs> At least he didn't try to kill me. Oh, please. You've been playing dead since the day I was born. Well, I wish you hadn't. Stop! Tenno, still functional. Listen carefully. Getting back to the surface is not going to be easy. I don't know how to break this to you, but your warframe, it's barely functional. You're going to have to stay low and out of sight. I know a shortcut, but you've got to do the rest. another up ahead. Watch for its pattern and try to get past it. Be patient. Let them pass before moving on. alive. That means we can fix this. We can get the heart back if we work together. will be willing to go back down? Sun and I can bait the worm to draw the infestation away, up to the surface. Even if I agreed to help, what about the necromax down there? Just one of those things. I've got a little something that I've been saving for an occasion like this. All right, I've got the calculus data for a restart, but I'll need 10 quanta of leptosam. Sun? I, I have it. Should we wake up grandmother? Let her sleep. Wouldn't want her to worry. 
It's too soon for them. Are you sure about this? Not at all, but we'll have to make an exception. Just this once. With the void closing up, you're gonna be too weak to help in that frame. Snake's in rough shape, but she's got enough juice for one last ride. What do you say? Ready to go old war style? All right. Not ideal. But I've cross-routed your Warframe impulse stream directly to Snake. Now, she'll feel heavy, but you'll get used to it. Head outside, and we'll run a field test before your descent. off a few rounds and get a feel for them. There's no time for training exercises. But we've got to prepare... Tenno, get down there. You're just going to have to learn as you go. To... Yes! Secondary systems are back up. Be exactly clear, but it, it should help. I've dispersed some specimens to keep the infested out of the way. Oh, so it's okay if you do it. Eat pover pellets, you take it easy. I've summoned some velocipods too. I've managed to bring additional systems online.
She's waking up. You should have additional functionality. Snake with an old Omni tool. Ready?
What do you think, Mother? Seal the chamber. Initiating restart sequence. By luck, we pass through and beyond. Chamber sealed. That's it for your ride. No one way trip for poor Snake. I'll cut the reroute as soon as the heart's beating. And you'll be back to your old self again. Restart in three, two, one. You're sure you've got the correct derivatives? Again. Three, two, one. Perfect. Just perfect. It doesn't make sense. Something must be interfering. I, I checked the equations. Well, check them again. Don't yell at me! Again! There it is! Tenno, you've got to destroy this thing, or we're back where we started! <laughs> you have no idea how jealous I am right now. Good send off. You have my thanks. Ah, oh, Snake. I'm gonna miss you. But you've earned your rest, alright? Rerouting you. Yes. A rest.
They're an insufferable lot, aren't they? My son, father, blustery and spineless all at once. His absentee wife, mother, who can't see past what she's lost, to see what she has. And who can blame the children? Daughter, trying to convince herself she's so different. It only makes her more the same. And the boy, poor son. He mistakes kindness for mediocrity. Who's he competing with other than himself? But, in a crisis, they can come together. I've no idea what you're talking about. But even as they've forgotten themselves, their names, their bonds, they might still be a family. It seems you're an important part of that now. So maybe I can help you and your family. This Warframe, Zaku, somewhat of a family themselves. A sum of many, a composite of others we lost in the ages that our Entrati family has served here. There. And now, I think we've had more than enough excitement for one day. <sighs> I could do with a little lie down. Tried it her way. And where did it get us? Just look at me. So now I'm doing things my way, like I should have done all along. We'll show them, won't we? You and me. Make them sit up and pay attention. The weapons? They're just one branch of the project. You keep on like this, and I might cut you in on more of what I've really been working on. You know what I'm talking about. Had a taste of it already, didn't you? I guess you know what's best for you. Be seeing you again, I'm sure. This would be where I showed you my birthright of ancestral fish, but... Well, you've already met my charming brother. Some remnants of the original genetic matrix appear to have survived in the exocrine, though the infestation is steadily claiming them. If you can catch any and bring them to me, I'd appreciate it. We can salvage anything useful. I can't undo what he did, but I won't let him have the last word. Until next time. This is not how I would have chosen to welcome a colleague. But embarrassment is a luxury I discarded long ago. Frankly, my daughter is an entitled self-pitying whelp. My son, an arrogant upstart, and my husband, a mealy-mouthed relic of his old self. Every last one of them has let me down. You may find them useful. I barely find them tolerable. If I can count upon your loyalty, we will work well together. I intend to tame this place, and you can help me. Disappointing. Me. Farewell. Hi, 
I'm... I'm not Lloyd. Lloyd is Lloyd. You'll have to excuse Otak. His personality was damaged irreparably by Deimos' energies, making it necessary to transfer his intelligence to this, our current shared form. Unfortunately, Will my attempted defragmentation of I his mean, persona uh, matrix minor? was not a complete success. Tell them about mining, Otak. Mining? Oh yeah, mining! There are things to be mined. Minerals! We'll use the minerals to make the, the things that are necessary for survival on Davos. Now, ask politely, Otak. Would you please mine the minerals? Well, see you again, ship. My family may choose to live in witless denial of our condition. But I accept it. Deimos is my mistress, whether I chose her or not. Her bitter kisses fester in my veins. Witness, Tenno, we are truly become one flesh. I crave to understand her for myself. Whatever you need to provide me samples of her processes and function, wildlife, I will provide. But if I am to understand them, I require them intact. You sedate them. I shall arrange retrieval. You shall be rewarded. You'll notice the life forms of Deimos are constantly ripping chunks out of one another. If you happen across a predocyte or a vulpophyla that's very well. Good. Good. Done. See you around. Welcome, Tenno. There is no doormat, but feel free to wipe your feet on my husband. He won't dare stop you. Perhaps. On Deimos, be aware of all things.